all about Africa. Africa is one of the most culturally, ecologically, geographically diverse of all seven continents. Today, we're going to learn interesting facts about amazing place. Africa is the sometimes called the mother continent or the cradle of humankind. Because it's the oldest inhabited continent on the earth, this means humans whose scientists called Homo sapiens and their accessors have lived on the African continent the longest. Would you believe over 5 million years? The African continent is the only place in the world where scientists has discovered fossils of humans and their ancestors through every stage of evolution. This ancestor, ancestors includes a Autrolopithecines, our earliest ancestors. Homo habilis, our two making ancestors. And Homo erectus, and the advanced relatives to Homo habilis that was able to walk upright. Today, Africa spent a huge geographical area of all about 12 million square miles, divided into 54 countries, the most countries of any continent on the planet. It's home over 3,000 indigenous people, over 1,000 languages, and as the total of population of about 1.1 billion people, that's roughly 15% of entire population of the Earth. surrounded almost entire, entirely by water, the Mediterranean Sea, the Red Sea, the Indian Ocean, and the Atlantic Ocean. It's divided half almost equally by equator and also include the islands of Cape Verde, Madagascar, Mauritius, Seychelles, and Comoros. The continent includes large mountain, tropical rainforest, grassy savannas, and desert. Here's a fan fact of all easternmost part of African mainland is a peninsula often referred to as the Horn of Africa. I got this name because of the land formation looks like a horn. By just looking this map, what country do you think is the largest? Algeria is the largest country by areas, but the country of Nigeria is the most populated with 185 million people. The smallest country is Seychelles, which is the nation 115 islands, mostly uninhabited islands in the Indian Ocean. Directly is the African continent other African countries include Ethiopia, with the second highest population on the continent. Egypt, which acts as an island bridge between Africa and Southwest Asia and is the size of the countries of France and Germany combined and Kenya, which is home of the city of Nairobi, the safari capital of the world. Africa is also home to one of the longest rivers in the world. The Nile, which is over 4,000 miles along, it runs south to north starting at Lake Victoria, which is one of the largest freshwater lakes in the world. And ending at the Mediterranean Sea, other cool geographical features include Sahara Desert which is the largest hot desert in the world and the Mount Kilimanjaro which is the highest point of the continent and the tallest volcano in the eastern hemisphere because of the African continent it's large it is land so diverse there's a lot of exciting attraction that bring the tourists all over the world to African countries 
One of the most famous tourist attractions in Northern Africa is Pyramid of Gaza. This pyramid were built by the ancient Egyptian around 2650 BC, over 2.5 million blocks of limestone. One of the best places to travel in Africa for a thrifty walking safari, South Luangwa National Park is also renowned for its excellent night rides. Most here offer expertly guided game walks, but the real deal is a multi-day trek between semi-permanent flight rounds, soaking up the sights and the scents of the bush without the distraction of a running engine. Tourist spots in Africa. Mount Kilimanjaro, or just Kil, to many in the climbing fraternity, is a major tourist attraction in Africa. For those seeking an adventure holiday, a trek to the peak of Mount Kilimanjaro is perhaps the epitome of such a vacation. It has three volcanic cones, Kibo, Mowenzi, and Shira. It is the highest mountain in Africa and the highest single free standing mountain above sea level in the world. Trivia The oldest person ever to summit Mount Kilimanjaro was 87 year old Frenchman named Valdi Daniel. And Bernard Gusen, a South African who twice scaled Mount Kilimanjaro in a wheelchair. His first summit was on 2003 that took 9 days and 4 years later it took only 6 days. He was born with cerebral palsy, Gusen used a modified wheelchair, mostly without assistance to climb the mountain. Adumo Dance The Adumo Dance is traditional dancing style that involves jumping is the second most popular African traditional dance on our list. It is performed by the Maasai tribe or Tanzania and Kenya. Meanwhile, the half jump performed by the dancer are most, more than just a form of entertainment. They present the warrior's strength, agility, and stamina. The culture of high reverence for the high spirits, Africans believe in the existence of higher spirits, some benevolent and others malevolent. Thus, we need to abide by the good statutes of the benevolent higher spirits to earn their favor and blessings as well as protection against the malevolent forces. This strong belief and reverence for the higher spirits exerts positive effect on Africans not to engage in loose moral life, lest lose the favor and protection of the good forces in nature.